What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be playing Infinity Magic Raid. Uh, as you can see, I've already been playing this game. Uh, I have some things open, some things I don't have open. The Forge, the Sanctuary, the Temple is still not open for me. But let's go ahead and show you some of our heroes. This game is kind of, um, it's a gotcha game. It's kind of, it seems to be, um, just, just, it's just a, some similar to some of the gotcha games already out there but these are some of the heroes you can get on here now it starts you off with this guy firewater christian and eden i think or is it yes eden she's the healer and it was one more but i don't remember who it is because i think i didn't build them i built somebody else but you do get epics and you do have legend legend ranks and i think you also have a mystic ranks but i think they're harder to get but you also can take your one stars and two stars and upgrade them but uh, they give you this guy right here on login too i haven't uh, i haven't used him either but i feel like he might be good i just haven't got a chance to build him yet now as far as the game go we do have dispatch mode which you can see here now, the one feature I like about dispatch mode on here is that uh, you can go here and hit lock and you can lock it so that on the next day it don't refresh. I'm, I'm guessing that's how it works. This is my first time seeing it when I was doing my uh, dispatch the other day, earlier today. And then you just hit on here and quick deploy, quick deploy and then dispatch. That's what I've been doing, and it usually it just puts in like a one star or a two star or whatever it needs to fill it in, and uses that. So it is vital that you keep some low level units that you can go ahead and put in here, so that they can go ahead and do that work for you and get you some extra goods. Now, oh yeah, on no dispatch it goes by color, so the gray is has a shorter time. Then it goes to green, blue, and then gold. But let's go on farther. So we got a marketplace here. You can buy some different stuff here. You can buy sets, you can buy, actually I want that right there, that multi stamina. So I haven't did my multis yet for the day. But um, you get potions gear characters everything shows up here you do have a re free refresh every day so i've been buying characters because you need characters to upgrade them anyway but i think you get them they drop from the store as oh that's a miracle room let's go ahead and pick that up i don't know if it's worth it though probably not but anyway we're gonna go to arena here i haven't did much arena but this is the arena store. You can get the, some of the same stuff in here. Uh, is that epic? That's a legendary. You can buy a legendary if you grind hard enough in this store. They have the event store. I think this guy's a legend too. No, he's an epic. He looks cool though. Like a straight fighter. As well as these dragon eggs, which you use those to, to level up characters. And when I mean level up, I mean just go in here and you hit quick craft and you can level them up like this. So you see right here on this one, they put dragon eggs in there for him. As though the other one, they put just regular characters in for them. So I'm not going to level these up right now because I don't think they're the ones I wanted to level up yet. You also can just go in here and craft and um, just use whichever one you try and level up. I want to level this one up. Wait, excuse me. Oh, I have the two. Yeah, that's right. I wanted to do two. I'll put all the units I want to put in there. And it'll do it for me. I mean, I'll uh, be able to level them up. We also have milestones here. Right here is just, I, I think this is just when people make it to these, these certain points that get put on here. So right here on my server, uh, this guy, he's been on the top for the longest. I don't know how to say that. Guvna. He's been on top for the longest, uh, but he had a couple of the other ones too, but it seemed like other people are starting to get above him in those. All right, so also we have, let me show you the arena real quick. 
classic arena. And you can go in here and fight people. As you can see, people are doing like some of these super strong characters in here is one the arena defense. You get that same type of stuff in games like Raid Shadow Legends. I used to play that game a long time ago. I played Raid in forever though. Well, I won't say that. I kind of log in and do a couple events every now and then. But it's kind of hard. You got to really grind Raid. But this one is a little less grindy. But most gacha games are grindy. And it's just what it is. But let's go ahead and do some wishes because I do have some wish build up. This is going to be your summoning pool. So you can go right here and just tell you each one. So this one has, oh, it does have like a 1% chance for epics, but it only goes up to epics. And then your excellent wish goes up to legend for just a point, a 0 0.7% chance, chance. And then supreme wish gives you eight point. 8% chance, but they really just try not to give legends out like that. It was the same like, oh, you do get a free wish. Let's do this free wish. We got her. I like this girl a little bit, but she's just, just elite unit. I might put her up, like start bringing some elite units up to like four or five and just use them. Cause they seem cool to me. Let's go ahead and drop Got two of these, but these are gonna be level ones, level twos, pretty much. You usually don't get any epics out of here. Some cool looking units. Oh, we got an epic out of that one. Let's see who this guy is. Vertigo. We got AOE damage buff and debuff. He might be good. What his AOE damage is on? That's a single enemy. That's the buff. It's on his uh three, but he only so that means he only get like got like five turns, bro. Like let's see how long get it. Only out of four turns, eh? Not that good. I'm really looking for somebody who can AOE clear waves, so I can just kind of rush through some fancy when I'm farming. All right, let's do the Supreme Wish. So, oh, also Supreme Wishes. I don't, I don't, Supreme Wish and Excellent Wishes, you get like, you can get a legend after so many times. So on this one, it says 97. On this one, it says 10, which these are really, really rare. As you can see, I only have four up here. Oh, that was a premium. That was a Miracle Wish that we bought out the shop. But that is closed right now, so. It doesn't, it only opens every so often. Speaking of which, uh, they do have like events. Let's go show you that real quick and then we'll come back and finish our summons off. But on the side, uh, where is it? Mm, let me go on a quest. No, this is just gonna be our quest, but they do have daily quests. And they do give you like different rewards for each one, each of your daily quests. I think one of these gives like a, a supreme thing. Here it is. No, that's challenges. That's our starting all challenges. Events. There you go. So you get different events, it's, and it, it's a calendar for it. So protect sword harbor is going on right now. Increased auto drop rewards, guild arena completion, and challenge Neldia ends today. And you got hero training goals. But this is the calendar right here. So you got a couple things starting up today. Wish goes. I think that's going to be. Um, I probably. Oh, it already started. Okay. I'm going to say I probably should wait on that. <laughs> but. This is how the schedule goes pretty much. And. You can look at them here too. But. Like, it says I got progression, progress on somebody. Oh, I do got progress. Uh, appreciate that. Oh, uh, it just took me a quick job. <laughs> it got me worked up. I thought I had something good coming in right there. All right. Let's finish doing these wisps. Maybe we'll pull a legendary out of this. Oh, she looks cool. Check her out real quick. 
Vero. So we got Vertigo, then we got Vero. She is silent, so she probably is gonna be good for real. Oh, she got a uh, low cooldowns on some of her AOE stuff too. She might be worth looking at. All right, got another fire water there, and we got another epic. This guy's name is Frey. Single dark target debuff. Let's see what kind of debuff he has. Let's say defense down. Not bad. It's probably good. I haven't went full on building the team yet. I just been using my the single legendary that I got. Oh, these two new ones I haven't seen too. Dale, Dale. Is this a girl or is this a guy? This looks more like a girl. Dale. Can he just pick the a better knife for her? And then we got. McGuire. He looks cool. Alright. Is this enough? I have five more of these after this. We are getting some new epics, which is good for me. It's going to help me be able to move through where I'm stuck at right now. I'm still stuck in uh, just regular mode. But I think I can already start on um the next difficulty if i'm not mistaken kaido 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 from one piece i got another dale i don't know what you do with dupes yet really this guy's new got that pestilence mask on Balsley poison He's one of my second poison people. I know he had like the elite poison person. She's new. Never seen her. Freak. A single damage. I mean, maybe I should start a single damage team. I do have a lot of good single damage people. Counterattack and bleed. Reeves. Maybe he's a cool epic. We have to see him. I kind of like counterattack in some games. I know Epic had a good, I mean, not Epic. Ray Shalos had a good uh, low level character that had counter on it, and he was just good. Buff, debuff, severe wounds. Bison. Bison? 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 All right, that's all I want to do on the summons. We didn't get. Oh, uh, we'll do our. We'll do our four. Um, Supreme wish to. Bam! Let's see if we get a legendary. No! Come on, guys. Lomas. All right, Lomas. You better be do some good stuff, bro. Oh, that's a legendary, guys. Bismarck. AOE damage. Let's see what you do. Single target damage on his on his basic attack. This one does damage to all enemies. You can get it on three turn down. This one does attack to all enemies. You can get it to a four turn now. It works. Um, he has a passive that attacks and has 34% chance to inflict a layer of dark lightning. And reduce tenacity. What does dark lightning do? Enhances some of his skills. Okay, so he wanna apply dark lightning and then attack him to do more damage basically. Alright, let's do another one. I like how they made the golden light go up in the air and come back down. Now this is Liz uh HP burning is supposed to be good, so she's probably good. And Mooler. That's my last one, guys. Protection shield. He might be a good, like, a protection person. Alright, let's look. I'm gonna let y'all see some of the gameplay on the way out, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And 
I'll see you when we come out with the next video, guys, on this one or on something else that you like. Right now, as you can see, I am stuck in coming. I think I can maybe do. Actually, we can't do hard mode yet. Why did it, one of my challenges somewhere said do hard mode? Well, I'll let y'all see the next level on here. I've been skipping through the story, honestly. So this guy right here, he does like really high damage, but you'll see right now. All right, guys, see you in the next video.